Marvin Art. I was at Walmart the other day and they had two rows of hair dryers just beautifully displayed. So of course I couldn't help myself and I went and I, why did I get a fancy color? Cause this is gonna be covered in paint two minutes. We don't know why. They also had a white one though. Infinity Pro Conair. Ooh, removable filter, tourmaline ceramic technology, and of course it's rose gold. Now the wattage says 1875. That doesn't super matter. What I liked about it is the small mouth. Um, also, what I like about it is there is not only two speeds, but two heats. So we have cool, warm, hot. So I'll put it back to cool, okay? And there's a cool shot as well. This could be a uh, pretty neat. I don't remember how much it was. I'm sure it was expensive though. But let's give it a try because my old faithful, which I use my Bay Bliss, Baby Bliss, I uh, was resining and I touched it and it, uh, it won't move anymore. I, I, can, I will try to fix it, but oh, let's com compare the mouth sizes very similar so these do have smaller mouths than regular hair dryers so you see this is what this is gonna look like look at your future you know what i mean but anyways let's give it a go i don't even have like um i'm just gonna use whatever colors i've mixed up like i'm not expecting like a miraculous beautiful thing you know what i mean <coughs> but i really couldn't just wait to give it a go so let us go down to here. So you can see, yeah. All right. So my pillow paint today, only because I don't, I didn't prepare my um, lid and eggshells. I haven't mixed a new can up yet. <clears throat> so I'm just using old paint that I have. This is a uh, Sherwin Williams color to go, which you can't get anymore. However, for tinted paints, I have been using Benjamin Moore, um, and they're not bad. The dark tints are thin, and the light tints are thicker, but they're, you know, if you kind of um, adjust a little bit, you can get what you need from them. So, what are we doing? What do I have here? Let's start with TLP Athena. By the way, this is called Sea Serpent, if you like this color. It's kind of a weird color, so... I'm not sure you'll really like it. I want to make sure, though, that I don't blow too much into my pillow because I don't want that dark stuff coming up too much. TLP Athena. What else have I got here? Hmm. Uh, why don't I do this? This is Amsterdam Red Violet. Like I said, I'm just, like, doing whatever, you know? I just want to see the blowout. Then why don't I do TLP Lemon Sorbet? Did I say this was a 12 inch wood board? I think I did. Uh, then why don't I do golden Payne's gray? I've still been planning for my Patreon classes, guys. It's really exciting. I finally have the backdrop for the class that people are gonna see in the video. I worked kind of hard on that. Um, so that's coming together nicely. I have a few more ideas for classes. So right now we're up to 18 modules. This is TLP Shimmer, which is kind of like a turquoisey gold. I don't know what it is. It's really gorgeous though. Um, yeah, so I'm really excited about that one. Okay, so choice. I think I have enough gold tones. Uh, why don't I, yeah. I'm gonna use a little bit of this funk, TLP funk. It's so bright, but pretty. We don't wanna go overboard with it. You know what I mean? Just like that. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's just give her a whirl, right? And here's my, oops, white cell activator. There's sneakers getting mad at all the passers by. 
Okay, but I sell activators and saying it's a bit sticky dicky, but should I? Yeah, I should probably. I'm just gonna thin it a touch only because I want my hair dryer to have as easy time as possible, you know? I'm just doing it a touch. And I'm really excited because all of my new, I'm not gonna tell you what I got them, but all the people who sign up for the different tiers get a different gift and I'm almost have them all ready to go. So I'm excited for that. I think gift giving for me, I much prefer giving than getting gifts. It makes me so excited. Okay, we are going low, low. have an overblow here that was probably more my fault I mean there's definitely I need to blow in there I definitely can work with it though except for I personally do not like this overblown stuff I know some people don't mind it I don't love it but you know what we're gonna do for the next one we're gonna use, we're gonna try it with this attachment to see what we like. We're just gonna let it sink for a bit. So like I said, I mean, kind of boring. It's just like a boring bloom, right? Let's, why don't we zhuzh it up a bit here? I'm trying not to zhuzh anymore, but sometimes you need a little zhuzh in your life, you know? Uh, if I could get a skewer open, that would be awesome. Where's my opening? That's okay, there's no rush. I'm still waiting for it to melt, but I am a skewer. I'm trying to get a skewer up. Okay, there we go. All right, this is so pretty. I actually like this part without any cell activator at all, but some of these lacings are really cool. You know? Um, like, I don't like these little corners here. I think probably if, if I worked with it a bit more, <clears throat> I could perfect it better. I don't think it was necessarily the blow dryer's fault and more user problem. You know what I mean? Sometimes it's user error. All right. I do like though, the other blow dryer I tried a few weeks ago, I forgot which one, um, the low, this worked better for me even in the low, like it blew. There's some hair dryers in the, I don't like what I just did there, in the low setting that don't blow at all, you know? Uh, I don't like really what's happening here. Uh, what are we looking at? Hmm, is this okay or weird? This is weird here, boring. All right, well, let's just spin her out. We're gonna do a little comparison, right? Except, well, I'll have to find more of this color pillow paint so they match. Oh, well, okay. Uh -huh. Here we go. I'm gonna spin gently just so I don't make like a humongous mess. Then we're gonna have to remember how I ordered, I think I kind of remember. God, that shimmer. Do you know what? That might be my new favorite color. Do you see that like uh, kind of turquoisey interference? How are we doing? Yeah, like it's okay. You know, I mean, um, maybe it's the background color that's throwing me off a bit. But these colors together are pretty, I bet, on a white background would look nice. God, I'm so sorry. Sneakers is super annoying today. You know why? We usually have a little bark collar for him. But he went to the groomer, so we took it off, and this is what happens. Just anarchy. All right, now. All right, cool colors. And but kind of boring. 
as a blue in general, but whatever, we're gonna stick with it. Okay, let me do a close up of this and then I, I will try to get sneakers to stop barking and then we'll use the other attachment and see how it goes. I like these colors. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, I didn't like it after looking at it. I liked certain parts, but the dark was really throwing me off. So I want to actually show you a difference. This is the color to go white. Also, they don't make it anymore, but it's much thicker than the dark base. And you'll find that with any mixed up paint. So I wanted to show you the difference of the blowout between a thick pillow and a thin pillow. I'll try to remember exactly what I did, but we have TLP Athena. And I believe I did this. So you'll see, now the problem is, some of my paints now might be too thin for this pillow. We'll see. Here's the Payne's Gray. I have the, I know I missed something, didn't I? Shimmer. This is probably my favorite part, the shimmer. Um, then, is that it, just the funk? No, could it be? What about some lemon sorbet? Go crazy, right? Um, and then funk, I guess. All right, so let's see the difference. Let me put it back in the middle. I'm curious to see too, actually. All right. White. There we go. hard to aim as you can see but you can see there's less there's no pillow that actually came up because it was thicker I don't love like what happened like weird but again I felt like when I was aiming somewhere it actually was like blowing to the side um, so I'll have to figure that one out I like the pressure though you know um so let's see let's take my skewer let's see if i can make this one look nice i don't know if i can so i still like the colors i just i'll do this way i just don't know if this is my type of bloom or not if you know what i mean you know like and also this paint is actually really old because they haven't made it in like a year I just happen to have a bunch. So it's kind of like, you know, paint can go bad, can't it? I just see the edges looking really weird of my paint. Uh huh. Let's see, what are we doing? I still like the colors, at least, right? Um, but I think that was a good lesson in thick versus thin i don't like this at all this is really boring me um but technically i mean who cares right i might end up scrapping this too i just really like oh god that that um shimmer over the panes gray is quite lovely um yeah kind of ugly I'm gonna have to spin it a lot. It's because it's so thick. See, 
see how it's not hardly like moving. Spinner, spinner. I wish I had my proper pillow mixed up. I just couldn't wait <laughs> to use this new hair dryer. I'm sure it would work, work different with my regular pillow. Um, yeah, I mean, like, whatever. The colors are pretty. This bloom isn't doing it for me personally. Um, I think it's, whose fault is it? Could be a bit of my fault. Could be a bit of the pillow fault, you know. Um, but I do like these colors, you know, but like, yeah, it's like, hmm, it's like very watercolory, which I don't mind watercolor looks. But again, is this a keeper? You know what looks really pretty? So I don't care for the pinks so much, but in this light, the Payne's Gray, the Shimmer, and the Lemon Sorbet on top, holy moly. Should we just do that? That looks so pretty. Okay, this is ugly. Um, you know what we're gonna do? Yep. First, I'm gonna take off these gloves because I'm gonna pretend I'm clean. I'm gonna put my attachment on and I'm gonna do my idea. I'm literally gonna do Payne's Gray, Two Piggies, Payne's Gray, and I'm gonna blow out a bloom vine. Even if it doesn't work, ugh, the colors just look so delicious. Let's see. See, that's the problem. You see, you see when I blow down? It goes on either side and not in the middle. That won't work for me, will it? Like we can't have that. So no, thank you for that. But don't worry, this is not a complete waste. I'm gonna make something pretty. Uh, if it's the last thing I do. Let me get new gloves. So, how are we gonna make something pretty on this 12 inch? With bad, not bad pillow, but like, you know, with thick pillow. Should we do a, um, and this whole thing was supposed to be about my hair dryer, which I don't even, oh, that's not it, which I don't even love. So what's the point of this video? We have to end on a good note. You know how I love my, happy endings I got in trouble for saying that but so let's try I'm just mixing my pillow a little bit let's make sure it's nice and mixed we're gonna give it a go again okay and I'm just gonna use those colors I want and no matter what I'm gonna pretend that it's a nice outcome okay because that's how we are today I'm gonna do a bloom vine Okay. I'll just push it this way a little bit. That's a lot. Okay. Um, let me cover this. God, we can't go away with not a win, you know? We need a win. Let me just stretch this way a bit. Stretcher this way. Stretcher that way. Stretcher that way. Stretcher that way. All right, let me get the boo blaze. And let's pray to the bloomy gods. All right, here we go. Payne's gray. Shimmer, shimmer, which is maybe our new color, right? Why, why, why haven't I used this all my life? Like I've used it, but why haven't I been obsessed with it? You know what I mean? That's my question. 
I get obsessed with a new piggy like once a month. I used to be obsessed with Lemon Sorbet. I'm not not obsessed with it, but they're also magical for different reasons. You know what I mean? Okay. Let's get her back this way. Um, is this a, really? I'm just going to leave it like that? Okay, if you say so. Like not even any variants of blue or anything? All right. I, that's what I saw, so that's what we're going to do. Do you think it's going to be too plain? I don't know. Okay, here we go. Come on, hair dryer. you got to work with me, you know? I'm trying to make you look good here. to like move her around you know all right do I see the magic I do see some of that magic. Just letting the white sink a little bit. I mean, it's kind of pretty, right? All right, let's start skewering. Um, And I'm going to stretch her back and forth to make this band thicker because I don't want to lose too much of the edge. Oops. Alrighty. Is anything else boring me? I don't know. It's kind of interesting, right? Uh, pretty. There's some maybe like thick things that are gonna bother me there. I hope it's not too busy. All right. I'm gonna start spinning a little bit to get her moving and then we'll see what we're doing. Oops, forgot to move out of the way. All right, yeah. I just want it off this side a little bit more. Well, she's definitely better than she was, right? Okay, one more little spin. I think she's done. Thank you for sticking with me. Tell me what you guys think of this hair dryer. I know at first it looked kind of hectic, but um, I think if I kind of make, do some more work with her a little bit and get to know her, you know what I mean? She'll be kind of nice to me. So uh, here you go like subscribe share let me know what you think are you gonna try this hair dryer um and love you guys i'm just gonna pop a boob way here and um see you soon bye